I need y'all to do me a favor. I'm gonna need y'all to guard your world. All right? Guard your world with your life. All right? When you're doing good in life, when everything is just rolling, you know, and you're you're doing this by yourself, like, yeah, you, pay, you probably may know a few people that are on the same path, but essentially you're by yourself, you're doing what you're doing, bro. Along the way, people are going to try to attach their life to yours. They're trying to get into your world. You have to guard your world, bro, because I'm telling you right now, the moment you start to bring people into your reality, that's when they're going to start to bring other people into your reality. That's when other people, people don't want to see you succeed. You feel me? People like you, like, for example, it could be some females that probably fuck with you hard. You feel me? Or, or a group of people that that you maybe work with or you go to school with and they fuck with you hard. You know what I'm saying? The moment, and, and they may stay, they, they fuck with you hard because you're doing, you're on your grind. And they're used to seeing you in your own zone. The second you want to bring somebody into your realm of reality that they may not be associated with, all of a sudden now, they're jealous. You feel me? All of a sudden now, it's just like, uh, I don't really, nah, you shouldn't be around this person. And that's how people, bro, when it comes to guys and it being in the streets, a lot of the times, guys get locked up because it be too many niggas in, 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 in one group that do too much. That one person will start to envy another person because, oh, okay, this person's pro I'm probably, to them, I might be showing them favoritism or whatever the case may be. You know what I'm saying? That there's a saying that that's um that they say, if you're gonna do a crime, do it by yourself. You feel me? You do it with anybody else, anybody else can flip on you. You know what I'm saying? You do it by yourself, you straight. But I'm gonna let y'all know now, bro. Guard your world. Don't allow people to try to you know, manipulate you or try to uh, say like, you know, or try to bring, again, bring more people into your world where you don't really even associate or really fuck with that type of energy. You get what I'm saying? When you talk, when you talk about a person who retains their energy, who got their seed, you feel me, who's glowing and, and experiencing all the good things in life, all of that good stuff, of course, you're naturally attractive. People want to be around that. That's life. That's, that's more life. People will <clears throat> easily, will easily try to attach themselves to you and try to drain your life force energy, all because like you're doing good, all because you're associating yourself with new people. You get what I'm saying? So we have to be we have to be aware, bro. You feel me? Guard your world. Make sure your inner world is your foundation. You will never lose a sense of identity. You'll never lose a sense of who you are. There are certain rules and regulations that you grew up with subconsciously, consciously within your life that you know work for you. Make sure you don't stray from that, whatever that that could be. Because again, I'm not the same person. I'm not. I'm not like you. You feel me? You can't. You came from a different light. You came from a different walk of life, and you have a certain perception. But you know, just just don't. This is why this is why I, I like to say focus on on myself and I, and you know I don't like to involve involve too many people or try to connect with too many people like no offense a lot of people do message me on my Instagram you feel me I'm not active on Instagram but I understand which with each individual it's a different type of energy I'm dealing with you know what I'm saying it takes brain power and all this other shit believe it or not you know yeah it's just a, mes a message responding back to you know somebody else but somebody else is telling me about their life their background and i have to perceive that you feel me i have to like take that in you feel me so in a sense also the same thing with social media when you're when you're like on facebook or instagram or where or whatever and people are like sharing these different things you're intaking these realms of reality now you are incorporating it into your world and really now your world is becoming artificial you don't want your world to become artificial. We live in an artificial ass world enough as it is. You feel me? Going to the fucking store to get a goddamn apple. You feel me? So just keep in mind that, um, you know, let's say you shit, you got a new girlfriend. It's going to be the same shit, bro. As soon as you get a girl and you retain your energy and she on point and she's doing what she has to do. As soon as that happens. Oh, my gosh. Oh, you. Oh, you thought you experienced uh, envy and hate now, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> nah bro wait till you get a girl because because now 
people are gonna be talking alleged saying this and that see this is why i don't i don't i don't even tell people my intentions i conceal my intentions bro you feel me the only and the only thing that i can say about my intentions are, is that they are good and i'm not trying to get over on, on anybody but other than that like nobody really needs to know what you're doing bro you feel me you don't have to tell everybody what your next move is going to be because that's you subconsciously kind of inviting them into your world they can't understand you they don't understand you what i'm telling you right now not a lot of people understand people who are vibrating at a high vibrational rate that's actually taking their time to to better themselves as a soul and a spirit you feel me they can't understand your world so if they can't understand your world they're gonna be like nah you can't do that or like nah that don't make no sense oh nah i think you should do this you feel me that's because they don't they don't even understand your world they don't even, they don't understand where you came from you know what i'm saying so just be mindful of that um and you know people will come people will try to be in your life in any way any way possible dog you know what I'm saying? When you retain energy, you really do attract more life. You have more life force energy, so that's what you are going to attract. But yeah, man, I ain't finna make this video too long. This is actually one of my little quick videos for today. I just had to like spontaneously drop this shit because, you know, um, shit ha shit happens in life. You get what I'm saying? And you could be you could be vibing doing your own thing, but once you start to associate yourself with other people. Now their problems become your problems. You get what I'm saying? Especially if you think, if, if you feel like, okay, yeah, this person I rock with, or it's just like me, if I associate myself with being a Miami Heat fan, guess what? We were, it's the end of the world because we lost, we lost game seven to the Boston Celtics at home in Miami. You feel me? So now I have to take on that vibration of like, damn man, Heat lifer. You feel me? Like I have to, I, it's like, fuck. You feel me? Versus like me just saying, you know what? I'm just going to be a casual basketball fan. Basketball is basketball. I love the Miami Heat. I'm from Miami, this, that, and third. But I'm going to take my mind and my energy and put it elsewhere. You feel me? Because at the end of the day, like, what is the NBA overall? It's just a, it's just entertainment. You know what I'm saying? So we have to be aware. Just like how with people, same thing with just shit that we watch. You know what I'm saying? So this is why we live in the Matrix. This is why we call it the Matrix. But yeah, like I said, without saying too much. You know, for the end of the video for today, like, share, comment down below. I appreciate all the love and support. This is a brand new month. Um, let's go. I'm going to be on fire this month. You feel me? I'm going to be dropping like, I'm going to try to drop like two, maybe three videos a day if I can. It's my birthday month. Next week, I'm going to be uh, the big three, two. So I'm really happy about that. So, you know what I'm saying? So let's get it, dog. Um, I ain't had no intro today because, yeah, I'm just, I just had to get straight to the point. But yeah, peace.